that, man. Well, it's over with. It's over. And, uh, yeah, we can just get the regular 2K now. And uh, y'all might be wondering what I'm talking about. I'm going to tell y'all what we're talking about in one second, man. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment something down below man just anything whatever y'all want to man this is gonna help y'all do two things man number one every single friday we give away 50 dollars in vc cash app or a copy of a video game number two this is the more important one. if we can average 8k views we own the way to doing that for this month we're gonna be giving away a next gen console whether it be an xbox a playstation or it could be 500 bucks or a laptop of your choice man last but not least the bots are down there man make sure y'all ignore those bots man we're gonna be doing the drawing for the uh 50 today and with all that out of the way Let's, let's, let's just get right into it, man. So check it out. Oh, let me start this video too, man. I'm, I'm extra lazy today, bro, because uh, we got we got a lot to talk about, a little time to talk about it in, and uh, we just going to see how this goes. All right? So check it out. Bow! This is what I want to know. NBA 2K leaks and Intel said, thoughts on Hog Hogwarts legacy so far. Is it worth buying? And a lot of people just talking about it. They wondering the same thing, man. That's something you can comment down there below, man. Let me know if Hogwarts is worth buying because, you know, I'm thinking about getting it. I want to do it for you guys on the stream and all that. But if y'all ain't going to watch it, bro, there's no point in me wasting my time, energy, money, or any of that, bro. But if y'all watch the stream today and you win the contest, you can get a copy of Hogwarts for free from me, your boy. So y'all let me know if that's something that y'all going to watch and watch me go through and stuff, man, I'll do that for y'all. But if not, Hey, just be honest with me, man. Just, you know what I'm saying? Just be straight with me. And let me know, man, because if, if y'all ain't interested, y'all ain't interested. It is what it is. Up next, we got my boy J.D. Rick, man. That boy said today's kids will never understand before NBA 2K this screen got us. This screen got us charged. I ain't gonna lie, bro. If you know what that is and you know what game that's from, hey, y'all used to hear that boy come out there. Double triple. Da -da 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 -da. Hey man, that joint used to be fire. Well, we used to just try to go up there, and when you try to dunk and you couldn't get the screen, and he would just like throw it in, and he'd be like, Well, that is a dunk. I don't care about that. Ain't nobody trying to hear that dunk. We want to see the real dunk, man. So, you know, uh, that, that was one of those things, man. Y'all know about that double dribble. My boy Jump Man Germ says, Fun fact NBA 2K had, uh, NBA 2K18 had a t shirt kiosk where you could get custom t shirts created by the community. The crazy thing about, about that one was, man, uh, you could get custom t-shirts uh, created by the community. Number one, the community went crazy with it uh, in a bad way. Number two, the community went crazy with it in a good way because uh, in a weird way, number one, they, they went, so you already know that. They went crazy with it in a good way because they made some fire shirts. And then number three, they went, you know, they went all bad because everybody had the little, uh, everybody had the pistol in the back of their shirt or, you know what I'm saying? They had the little bulletproof vest on and they had everything, man. So some of the stuff was good and fire, but some of it was bad. I just got tired of seeing that pistol in the back by, by, by people that ain't never even seen a firearm before. Like that, that got, that got old real quick. But you know, the people was having all the weird stuff, man. And then also number two, uh, and this is the more important one, 2K, uh, they had to shut a lot of them down because, well, out of the kiosk because people were putting name brand logos on there. And then, you know, they had to, um, I can imagine the conversation with something like this. Uh, well, we're not selling the shirt, so like you can you can make something that is copyrighted, but as long as you don't sell it, so you can you can infringe on copyright as long as you're not selling it or making money. And so there was like, well, how do they get those shirts? And then there was like, well, they gotta buy, they gotta pay VC. And they was like, well, where do they get VC from? Can you you can earn it in the game? but you can also buy VC. So it was like you were paying money for it. So it was a gray area. So you technically were. So they had to go in. They either had to clear the t-shirt shop out or they had to make all the shirts free. They elected to make all the shirts free. So because you're not selling something, you're not infringing on the copyright because you're not making any money off of it. Number one, you're not, you're not, you know, you're not, you're not taking away their ability to make it. It was a whole story about it. We did that in 2K18, man. It was crazy. But the t-shirt shop was a good idea. I liked it. Um, you can make your own custom stuff, but you already know the community went wild with it, and it, it just wasn't a good look. Up next, we got that boy Jumpman Germ again. Boy, that boy say, fun fact, NBA 2K20 had red ball, ball, red ball blue ball event uh, glitch where you could get 50K VC every few minutes. Whew, I ain't gonna lie, man. It was some of the greatest glitches of all time. Because the greatest glitch of all inside of me 
Y'all already know what it is, man. If y'all got some of that red ball, blue ball in, man, we were getting it in, man. I was always on red ball team, though. I ain't talking about, now, God, can I? I was like, God, can I have a red ball? Because I, I I couldn't be on the blue balls team. Never been on that team before in my life, son. In my life, son. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Maybe we get to a dope thing not here today, man. Up next, we got my guy. He said, hey, creator of creator Justin. He just said, bro, these rake randoms are the absolute worst. And uh, I'm trying to figure out what he's talking about. Uh, if you can't see it, I just want you to feast your eyes right here on this young man who is standing blast open, man. And uh, let's see. Let's see what happens. He's open. He's open. He's even more open. He's still open. He's still open. Certainly he's going to pass it now or he's or, or at least now he's going to make this pass to the corner. Right. Because he thinks he's nice. Right. Right. Like Gilly would say. Right. But nope. Yep, he tries to make the pass. He tries to make that pass and gets it stolen. When, if he just makes the pass right here or makes the pass, uh, or he can just easily just make the pass right here. Just a quick one, two pass. One, two. You can make that quick pass and you out of there, man. But you know, people, we're not going to do that in the wreck. My guy Don Work, he got a whole video on how these boys ain't going to do right in the wreck. And it's all good because we know what we what we getting into when you go into the wreck that's why we don't expect to win man but that ain't what we all here for what y'all here for is to see that first legend stuff man and we got all that stuff right here for y'all man that boy says hey congratulations to the first legend on current gen included uh you know w reward w grinder and uh so y'all already see we got the professor x floating throne it said first legend uh, you know, on current gen or what have you. And then these are the rewards that you get, man. You get legend rewards, WRL, and that's what Garcel is asking, man. So he says you get the uh the hover throne, animated, uh, animated player panel board, and then you get uh you get eight badge points. I ain't gonna lie, man, them eight badge points might be worth it in and of itself, but uh, you know, it is what it is. And if y'all wanna see what this hoverboard uh, the, the hover chair looks like, we got it right here, man. And it's in action, man, the hover throne. So he's flying around in the hover throne, throne. You know what I'm saying? It's just like Professor X, man. You just going around with the king. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm still king with my crown of thorns. Y'all already know what it is, man. So hey, that's that's what you get, bro. You get you get the hover joint. And uh, I don't know. A lot of people are actually saying that they feel like that the that the current gen rewards are better than the next gen rewards i don't really know man that's one of those things that i think y'all gonna have to debate out down there in the comment section i really couldn't tell you um because i think it really is going to come down to uh eight more badge points or the core system being able to core anything that you want to in any category in any configuration and uh you know i, I think that's all they really got it where they got a low rider eight badge points I mean, no, they got a low rider. They got to be able to core everything. And then, I mean, he got a logo and some other stuff, but it really wasn't even that good, man. But uh, I don't know, man. Y'all got to let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Which one do y'all think is better, the next gen or the current gen rewards, man? And which game do y'all think is better? Like, I, I, I ain't going to lie to y'all. I'm going to keep it 100% stacked with y'all. I hope y'all are telling me y'all want to watch Hogwarts because right now, I mean, I'm, I'm, I see people playing 2K, bro. I can't even stand to watch 2K right now. I just don't even want to. If I ain't, like, we trying to get in the Pro-Am, and if we're not playing competitive, a, a comp rec game or, a, you know, a rec, a rec team that's on our level that's that's going to give us a hard time or something like that, I, I, I really don't even, I, I don't know what I'm where I'm at with the game. I could just be suffering from burnout, man, and I think that's what it is. But it's all good, baby, baby. We're going to get it done. We're going to make sure we get stuff right. And we're going to keep grinding and keep giving y'all this fire content. I know a lot of y'all like that jump shot yesterday, so I appreciate that, man. Appreciate y'all showing love on that, man. Uh, make sure y'all like this video. Comment down below, and I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Town. Boy, they got my Gatorade in the background, boy. Hey, I had the little sniffles, man, so I had to get that Gatorade. I gotta, I, I gotta get me a green tablecloth so my table will be invisible. But we gonna holler at y'all next time. Peace. Guys, please. Guys, please.